Welcome back to Anything German Shepherd. Being such a long-haired dog, you'll need to brush your German Shepherd at least twice a week. But sometimes, low-quality brushes make this simple process quite challenging, which makes it that much more important to choose quality products. Let's now go over what to look for in brushes for German Shepherds. Longer bristles are better for German Shepherds so that they can reach the bottom of their thick coats. You'll also want to ensure the brush you're buying is made of wood or high quality plastic, and that the bristles are embedded firmly and don't come off. The brush should also be soft so that it doesn't hurt your dog, and avoid brushes with sharp ends or extra firm bristles. And since you'll be brushing your dog often, go for a brush that feels comfortable in your hand. Let's now go over the types of brushes for German Shepherds. Bristle brushes have soft, long bristles to grab the hair and pull it straight without yanking out large amounts. While bristle brushes are great for German Shepherds, they won't be enough on their own since they don't reach underneath to detangle the undercoat. Instead of bristles, wire pin brushes are set with wire type pins set in a soft base material. These pins can move and flex as well, which keeps them from scratching the skin or yanking out huge amounts of hair. We recommend using the longest and most flexible pins for German Shepherds. Slicker brushes have pins with no rounded ends, meaning they'll grab a lot more hair. The pins of these brushes also tend to be thinner and shorter than those usually found on wire pin brushes. While brushing does a good job of removing tangles and matted fur, a comb is the only surefire way to deal with them. Combs help to keep your pet's hair smooth and silky at all times, and remember that the best comb will be one your dog is comfortable with. And finally, de-shedding tools push the hair into channels so that they can be separated. They work by going underneath the top coat and removing loose hair from the undercoat. When dealing with serious tangles, there's no substitute for a de-shedding tool. And developing the right technique is also important. You'll need to develop the right brush stroke, brush down and out, and be gentle. That's all for today. Thanks for joining us. Feel free to subscribe and hit the like button. Until next time.